angry guy here and men are thriving overseas. Men are thriving overseas. We're going to jump into this video. I want you guys to check this out. This is so cool. Have a look at this. So this is a house in the Philippines, fully furnished for $18,000. Just look at this. This is absolutely beautiful. Look at the living. Look how beautiful this woman is. You know, I mean, this is, look, look at, this is premium living. And, you know, you could not imagine this kind of life in the United States. You look at, I mean, look at that shower. This is absolutely beautiful. This is absolutely insane. And I think everyone should take it as, take that into consideration. There are a lot of people who say, oh, you're going to go to the Philippines and you're going to lose all your money. You know, there's a lot of, uh, there's a lot of bias, but I personally, but I say it's a, it's a lot of bullshit. I mean, look at how great these people are doing. Look at this. This is just absolutely incredible. This is phenomenal. You know, I mean, you, they have the water cooler in the house. They are comfortable. They have two recliners. I mean, the house looks nice. They have a television set up. I don't know if the guy has his video games there. Maybe great TV. The, I mean, they've they've decorated the house so, so lovely. I mean, and this is their home. This is their home. This is their property. You can see her here. You know, there's like a breeze blowing, maybe the air conditioner. I mean, look at the happiness on this woman's face. This is, and, and this, and they own this. I mean, for, you know, what you pay in rent, you know, this is, this is, this is what they tell you. Oh, you're going to go to the Philippines and lose everything. Cause you know, in the Philippines, you cannot own property by yourself. You have to be married. You have to have, um, you have to own it jointly with another person. So your wife would have, would also have ownership of the property. Here's the thing, guys, $18,000 gets you this. Bro, we spend more in rent. $18,000 is not shit in rent in the United States. And this is what you get a fully furnished house in the Philippines. You've got to be kidding me. You've got to be kidding me. All right. That is a great investment. Imagine if you move to the Philippines and you have 10 good years with this woman. 10 good years and then you break up. Hell, even five good years. The amount of money that you're going to save living in the Philippines with your Filipina, if, you, if you're a person that can work from anywhere, and it's something I'm going to be teaching you guys again, how to work from anywhere in the world, how to build a, how to build a, how to build a business and work from anywhere in the world. We're going to put a lot of work and a lot of emphasis on that because you want to do that. There are a lot of, there are a lot of jobs that you can do. There's a lot of things you can do online that allow you to work from home build your business, build your brand. And there are a lot of normal jobs you can do while working overseas. I mean, every there are things like in uh, there are things such as uh, such as cybersecurity even that you can do remotely. And you can do this shit overseas as long as you have a solid internet connection. There's so much work you can do. So so much work you can do from across the world and you can make that US dollar and it goes so far and your Filipina is going to be happy. Your children are going to, your, your kid is going to be happy. Everything. I mean, my gosh, look at this, you know, and you have your wife, you have your baby. I mean, you can't, add, you, they've got a television in the bedroom. I mean, look at this. They've got an AC in the bedroom. Guys, like, this is living. We can't, we can't imagine this in the United States. We cannot imagine this in the United States. And look how, be, look, look, look how, I mean, color coordinated. And of course, your Filipina is going to set everything up. Come on. Come on, guys. So I just wanted to show you what you can look forward to when going to the Philippines. All right. Including the beautiful, um, beautiful Filipina. You know, look at that beautiful kid. You can have your own little kid like that. Beautiful bed, color coordinated. Your Filipina is going to keep that house so clean. You don't even have to wear, you know, in your house, you don't have to worry about wear, walking around and slippers. You can walk around barefoot because that floor is so clean and the weather is always nice. You know, I mean, my gosh, your girl speaks English. I mean, listen to me. You have everything you need. You have everything you need, and that's it. I mean, and, and almost everything you could ever want, you know, because you have your family, you have your home, you have your Filipina. Don't let the haters stop you. Don't let these women put you down in America. Don't listen to them. Don't listen to the Sims. Go overseas. Get yourself a Filipina, or you can go to Thailand or what another country. Again, it's up to you. Me personally, I think I'm, I'm going to go to Philippines to get myself a Filipina. 
and you know put down some roots over there i mean this is just so wonderful this is absolutely beautiful you have to be mindful everywhere you go there's a website called christian filipina that you guys can check out as well i might start advertising them if i can get an affiliate link with them if i can you know get a partnership i don't know about affiliate link i want a partnership like they need to get me a partnership you know i want my money up front but anyway definitely guys definitely i give them a little free advertising right there and there's some and they, and they work with some different content creators too but i wanted to show you what you can get look at this big backyard look how lovely this is guys anyway that's everything i have for you right now are you amazed at what you can get that you get this for you get a fully furnished house for eighteen thousand dollars in the philippines with with the filipina included i mean look at this look at this oh my gosh you've got to put patio and I'm a person who likes to raise animals. I want to raise chickens and, and and stuff like that. So, I mean, with this amount of land, I think that's very, very possible. I think it's perfectly legal over there in the Philippines to raise animals. You know, I'd love to raise 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 chickens, maybe have a couple of, have a goat or have a goat, you know, some things like that. And at the end, it's, that's, that's, that's just absolutely awesome. Some rabbits, fresh rabbit meat. Anyway, guys, let me know what you think in the comments if you're looking forward to this, if you want this. Like I said, forget about MGTOW. Walk away. Walk, go towards greener pastures. We all want women. We don't want to live. We don't want to die alone. Let go of that hatred. You know, that, that hatred, don't, put, don't put your hatred on all women in this world. Don't put your hatred on your on the Philippines. Look at this white dude. Look at look at look at all that this man has. It's not a black. It's not a black or a white thing. It's a man thing. Men are leaving these women behind. They're leaving the black women behind. They're leaving the white women behind. They're leaving the American woman behind. They're leaving the Western woman behind. And they're going overseas and getting themselves themselves a woman who appreciates them and is grateful to have them. All right, and that's about it. Let me know what you think in the comments. If you like the video, go ahead and hit that like button. Don't forget to subscribe. And if you like the video, share the video. And just remember that all roads lead to MWA, men walking away, and cheers.